Hey, how's everyone doing today? One of the easiest ways as a beginner to learn improvisation is to use the blue scale. Okay, so in today's lesson, I'm going to show you guys an easy lick that's based off of the blue scale that you can use that can help you sound great when improvising. Stay tuned. Hey, how's everyone doing today? This is Jason Thompson from the Smooth Jazz Sax School. And before we begin, go ahead and click the subscribe button and the bell icon so that you can be notified when I put out more Smooth Jazz videos like this one. So in today's lesson, I'm going to show you guys an easy blues lick that you can use uh, to help you sound great when improvising. I heard this blues scale... Well, I heard this blues lick uh, from Gerald Albright. So if you don't know who Gerald Albright is, make sure you go check him out. Uh, you won't be disappointed. One of the best saxophone players I've ever heard. So this lick is going to be in the key of A minor for alto sax and D minor for tenor saxophones. Okay, so the A blues scale for alto sax, the notes are A, C, D, D sharp, E, G, and then A. For tenor sax, that'll be D, F, G, uh, G sharp, A, C, and then D. That Those are the notes of the blues scale. So this lick uh, is just only going to be comprised of those notes for the most part. So here's how the lick sounds. <laughs> Okay, so the first part of the lick sounds like this. Again. And all we're doing is starting from high A. So this is for alto sax. We're going to start from high A, and we're going to go down the blue scale all the way down to low G. So A, G, E. D sharp, D, C, A, G. Again, A, G, E, D sharp, D, C, A, G. Then the next part of the lick sounds like this. Again. And all he's doing is going between a and G. A, G, A, G, A, G, A, G. Okay, so he does uh, A to G four times. A, G, A, G, A, G, A, G. And the last part of the first part of the lick is A, B, C. Okay? A, B, C. So the first part of the lick sounds like this. One more time. Okay, so now the second phrase, uh, he does the same thing, but he kind of switched it up just a little bit. Now he adds in this turn. And it sounds like this. So he does, it's still the same blue scale going down. So A, G, E, D sharp, D, C, A, G. But he adds in a turn. So he goes, goes from A to B flat, back to A, and then goes down the blue scale. So A, B flat, A, G, E, D sharp, D, C, A, G. And then the next part of that lick goes A, G, A, G, C, A, G, A. So 
So that second phrase sounds like this. Now the entire lick sounds like this. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that lesson. Uh, make sure you guys use that lick over some minor chords. I'll uh, see you guys next time.